What's happening folks and welcome to another episode of Stars of Tomorrow, an FM22 series where we look at Young Town on Foot Manager and we just see how they get on the course of their careers to give you guys an idea before you go and buy that new player for your team that you've been searching for. Don't forget guys, before we go any further, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for daily FM content. Down below is my FIFA channel and my Let's Play channel. If you've got a player you want to get involved or in this series with, or get play in this um with various like get the player in the series um leave a comment down below or if you want to join discord and get involved in that is also section there as well if you decide to join for more than that reason obviously and leave his name and basically get as much info as you can about the player name position age personality or club all that kind of thing also down below is my schedule for the series so you can see what's coming up so make sure your player's not been already requested and i'll check the playlist as well to make sure your player's not been done already because you know it saves you a bit of time Today's player is again from, I think, Discord again. It's the last player from Discord we do. Now, I will say, not every player is guaranteed to be done. It's a case of if, if they develop or not. But I do give as much as I possibly can. So today's player is Kale George. A striker, another striker again. Um, I think all the ones we've requested so far have been strikers recently. Um, a striker from Juventus. Now, the one downside this player immediately is he's out for three to four months with a torn, with a torn fine muscle. So straight away, that's a problem. He has got a max potential rating potential of 170 though. So that's, but we have to factor the equation on this occasion that maybe the injury will hold him back a bit in the early years, in the early few months of his career. So again, nice physicals, good mental stats, looks quite well balanced and the finishing and technique and composure, the triangle of finish I like to call it, is still is, is very good as well. So, um, Look at his development, what his traits are, no real traits on him right now. Reasonable left left foot, very strong on his right foot. Um, there's no reason to call his contract I'm aware of. Um, well, not aware, it's not even there. Uh, but I did do a scout report for you guys, um, for hit for you. Um, so a look, as you can see here, not interested in joining transfer, very interested in a loan deal, uh, very excellent performer, could have a long-term injury. When did he sign his contract? Let's check that. So 2021. So you can't sign him in the first season, but you've got a... Oops, sorry. Do apologise for that. But you do have a idea of his evaluation based on his like £90 million to £28 million. So bear that in mind when you're trying to sign his game, though that range is saying that. Um, so this could not be the best start of his career based on the fact he's got a massive injury, which is obviously not going to help but we'll see how it gets on all right folks so obviously he's now injury free after the first few years 23 years old now there's been a increase in valuation and is very looking to sign him not much increase in his overall abilities here um slowly one or two are creeping up a little bit but the injury will hold him back a little bit now let's look at the injury record and see what's happened since that so since then no injuries that is very good uh, that is a promising it's not it's not like he's had a few after that big after that serious one there so how did he get on so when he's back in football 14 and 5 in Serie C but then back in Serie A I got 4 then he got he's not been playing much is he but then this year actually he got 10 goals and 8 assists I think this guy is just he, he's got a goal eye for goal just the injury is really going to hold him back so this scenario um, in terms of players I thought well I've got to try and get this guy shown because the injury is locked in uh, and I think the question people are we're having is is he worth signing even though he's got out for three or four months so obviously now he's back playing football he's got 10 goals this season in the league will he get regular football somewhere else and kick on let's find out shall we right folks at Bayern Munich and I would say he's recovered quite well from his earlier for his injury at the start uh, worth 31 to 93 million pound that's a really weird feature this year injuries again not really oh eight month injury for Darius Le Christian Ligaments now hopefully that's just two random injuries not a sign of maybe he could be prone to it he didn't see that in the scout report did it at least so career stats so Juventus kept him didn't really use him 13 goals that season moved on to Bundesliga to, Bayern, to Dortmund got four and three didn't play him goes to Bayern Munich though and gets six, 18 and five and then 18 and nine so when you do play him he does score the goals in the top divisions so I still have getting for 20 million pound then they sold it and they sold 55 million in a season when he barely did anything so he's got an eye for goal 
Um, he really has. He just you need to play him. Um, so I do think he's worth having, even though the injury is a problem at the start of the of his career or the start of the or save. You have clearly seen when he's in Serie A, he scored uh, door figures. He's done with Bayern Munich as well, 18 in, in both seasons. Then when he's been played, so playing he scores. Uh, just maybe these guys, maybe he's not, maybe will players are coming to the team that maybe they fancy more. So. No quick jump, guys. We're going to quick look, see if he can, if he, if he moves again, will he get the figures in the league he's in? All right, folks, going to Real Madrid. Uh, we're not going to look at injury record. Long, a quick look, glance at that. Nothing, nothing serious there. So, Bayern Munich didn't play him. Goes to, yeah, just didn't play him. You play him, he scores goals. Essentially, you play him, he scores goals. It's 20 million pounds, I think, about right for him. Um, I think you've got a Bite the bullet on him if you really like him. You could make him a winger if you wanted to. Um, he, he's got he's got this strong and reasonable left foot and right foot. So could be a winger. Um, the only downside is that I think the injury holds him back. Um, in this, in, uh, to be honest. But when he has been playing regular footballs, we've seen here in the Bundesliga. He got in the Bundesliga for Bayern Munich. He got 18 goals back to back, and the one season he got at least we got 13 goals in Serie A. So he does score goals. You just got to really persevere with him. Um, and the problem is that injury could be a problem for your guy, for you guys. He's, like I said, he's got a max potential rating of 170. Um, so it's going to be 150. So he didn't actually reach that. Uh, be, reach that unfortunately so yeah um let me know guys in the comment section what you think about this guy is he worth a punt in your opinion i think he is for the right club i think obviously the injury was just slowing down a little bit but yeah if you enjoyed the video i hope you have hit that like button down below subscribe if you're new as well if you've got a player you want to look at like i said in the comment section you can put his name best get as much info as you can or if you're in discord you can put it in there as well um and i will obviously update you i update this the schedule down below every night at 9 p.m when I'm at home, so that will be updated. So you know when, you, when your request goes on, you can see always oh, seen it. He's put it on, and when I record the video and upload it, I give the update saying it's recorded, and you get a date as well. So you don't have to worry, wonder when it's gonna go live. Um, check the playlist as well. Make sure it's not been done already. If your request down below the TV channel and my Let's Play channel, please go check those out as well. And I'll catch you all in the next one, which I'm gonna record immediately after this one. But until next time, thank you for watching. Bye bye.